On Friday, Airbus surprised everyone with a statement that began with, Analysis of a recent event involving an A320 family aircraft has revealed that intense solar radiation may corrupt data critical to functioning flight controls. In parallel, it released an emergency airworthiness directive that required anyone operating the affected aircraft upgrade the software on a component called the Elevator Aileron Computer, or ELAC. This is apparently related to an event last month where an Airbus performed a sudden uncommanded dive before recovering. This caused a momentary low-G and hyper-G situation which injured a number of passengers. The aircraft diverted to the nearest airport so that passengers could receive medical attention. So what is the link to solar flares? Are Airbus really worried that their aircraft could fall out the sky if there's a big solar storm? I don't think they've definitively linked this problem to solar radiation. What I think happened is their engineers have looked at the affected flight computer and they found some memory corruption, a small amount of memory corruption, and tr despite their best efforts, they've been unable to explain this corruption via any other mechanism. But this small change in memory had big effects on the aircraft. So the engineers have developed a fix which will make it more robust against this minor memory corruption and this is being installed on all the aircraft. So that regardless of the cause of the memory corruption, the aircraft will not do something dangerous. Aircraft that are operating at altitude have a lot less atmosphere between them and space and so they experience higher rates of cosmic rays. Yeah, that could conceivably cause memory corruption which couldn't be explained by any other mechanism, but it's also possible that there's a problem which they haven't yet identified. And by making the system robust against this, they're making things safer.